Hi, I'm Niklas, and I'll be talking about King, a novel gradient-based generation procedure for safety-critical driving scenarios. The distribution of driving situations is extremely long-tailed, and critical scenarios are rarely observed in real-world data. As a consequence, they are usually underrepresented in common driving datasets. This is a problem in particular for learned end-to-end -end driving models, which are brittle to out-of-distribution inputs and require diverse and dense coverage of all possible situations in their training data. Training and testing in simulation promises to be a scalable solution to this problem. Current simulators, however, build on handcrafted scenarios which exhibit simple behavior and need to be manually retuned to each driving agent under test to yield interesting situations. Instead, safety critical scenarios can be generated automatically by framing this task as an optimization problem from the perspective of adversarial attacks. Starting from an initial non-critical situation, we iteratively re-simulate and perturb the scenario with the driving agent under test in closed loop. In each iteration, we adjust the scenario's parameters, in this case the trajectories of other agents, to make the scenario more challenging for the driving agent. These safety-critical perturbations then serve as augmentations to the original training data and can be used to fine-tune driving agents for better collision avoidance. Because driving agents and simulators are not always differentiable, previous work has relied on blackbox optimization to solve for safety-critical perturbations. This, however, can be unreliable and is difficult to scale to a large number of parameters. In this work, we propose King, which solves for safety-critical perturbations via backpropagation. Given a dataset of initial non-critical situations and a driving model trained on this data, we start by parameterizing these scenarios via a kinematics model, where the trajectories of other agents are represented by the sequence of actions they execute throughout the simulation. To generate a safety-critical perturbation, we simulate the scenario with the driving model in closed loop and compute a driving cost, which measures how well the model does in the current variation of the scenario. If all components of the simulation, so the kinematics model, rendering function and driving model, are differentiable, we can adversarially adjust the parameters of the scenario to increase this driving cost via backpropagation. However, this assumption limits the kinds of rendering functions and driving models that can be used. With King, we propose an approximation to the true derivative by stopping gradients through the rendering function and driving model during the backward pass. We find that this performs similarly while allowing non-differentiable components to be used. The resulting generation procedure is over 20% more successful in finding safety-critical perturbations than blackbox optimization-based alternatives. Additionally, we find that by fine-tuning on the scenarios generated by King, we can improve the collision avoidance of an end-to-end -end imitation learning-based driving model by over 50%. King can generate diverse types of safety-critical situations, one of which being aggressive cut-in maneuvers. In the following video, we show how Transfuser, a state-of-the-art imitation learning-based model for the Kala driving simulator, handles the situation. On the left, we show the initial non-critical scenario while also visualizing Transfuser's RGB camera and LiDAR inputs. In the safety-critical variation of the scenario, the agent in the right lane is perturbed to perform a lane change maneuver, which is not sufficiently covered in Transfuser's training data, resulting in an avoidable collision. By evaluating on unseen traffic, we show that fine-tuning on King's generated scenarios leads to improved collision avoidance. Thank you for listening. If you're interested, you can find additional information by following the link in this QR code.